Hey, Pastor Steve Waldron here. I'm going to do a comparison between this KJV Reader's Bible, which I like so much, and the local church paragraph Bible. Now, obviously, the local church paragraph Bible is going to be fantastically priced, amazing. I've done a video review or two on this paragraph Bible, and uh, you know, it's, it's one of the finest Bible deals you can get. It's like maybe $50, $55 with shipping. It's probably going to be $65. They do get you at, at local church on the shipping. It's going to have the raised book bands, dual ribbon markers, on and on and so forth. So let's say once it's out the door, you're looking at $65 for this. This is for shipping and everything. Well, this at Ollie's was $15.99. So let's say after tax and everything, 7% tax here in Georgia, you're looking at around $17. Well, first of all, this is going to come with a box and an amazing box too. I mean, I don't know if you can hear the thickness of this box, but it's a fantastic box. Whereas this is just going to come wrapped in two pieces of paper. And this isn't like a, a leather soft hardback, but it's beautiful. Now, of course, there's going to be no comparison in quality. You can see the size. But we're going to jump right on the inside. I've done a review on this Reader's Bible. I'm so impressed with it. And let me see if I can get this up. And you're going to see that the pages... The print size is almost identical, even though the Holman Bible is smaller. That the print is going to be very close to identical. Now, I don't think either one of these are going to be red letter. You are going to get another ribbon marker with the local church. But now, if you want to keep it on a shelf, like on a bookshelf, obviously the hardback is going to last you a whole lot longer. Now, this is just not going to have all the bells and whistles. And it's going to have maybe a little more ghosting because the quality of paper is not quite where the local church is. And another thing is the uh, some of the drop-capped letters. That's not everywhere. It's not going to have the little wood cuts in here like the uh, par the local church is going to have this, you know, the wood cut. So overall, let's just cut to the chase. The local church Bible publishing is going to be $65, whereas this one, that's total out the door shipping you get, where this is going to be $17 if you get it on sale at Ollie's, maybe even cheaper than that. Um, this is going to last you. The local church is going to last you much longer. Now, on a hardback, you're going to have to do, do your due diligence and break in a Bible. I've done a video on how to break in a Bible. Because that's what gets hardbacks. It's not that the hardback messes up. It's that the, the spine breaks and pages begin to fall out. Or entire signatures begin to fall out. So... You do that. Now, this is actually as well. I don't think any of them have red letter. I'm just double checking. I know this one does not. Um, this actually does give you the nice Holman maps. I do like the Holman maps in the back. Whereas the local church Bible publishing is not. So at the end of the day, you can buy four of these for the price of one of the local church. So it really depends on what you're going to use it for, you know. Um, for readability and everything, this is going to be the best. This is going to last longer if you carry it with you, which I don't recommend carrying uh, paragraph Bibles to church with you because you can't find, you know, it doesn't have the verse divisions. I'm going to see. Yeah, this one doesn't have the verse divisions either. And this one... Again, the ghosting is very pronounced in this one, but it does have nice kind of a opaque Bible paper. You can tell they really tried to do a good job on that. So, it, you know, if you're going to give them for gifts, most of us don't have $65 to give people, you know, especially if you're buying multiples for graduates or something. I would get this one. 
Um, if you don't have a lot of money to spend, get this one. Check the price on Amazon. Check the price on eBay. Oak Shelf Books on eBay, but just punch it in on eBay. Reader, the Reader's Bible from Holman. Um, if you if you've got a little bookshelf that you keep your books on this one is going to be much better this one's going to be the much better reading experience and the higher much higher quality bible and last you longer but again maybe you just want to read the bible through once or twice in paragraph format which i recommend everybody to do the verse numbering basically wasn't in the bible most of the bible anyhow you know maybe lamentations maybe uh you know psalm 119 or something but most uh, most of the bible anyhow not all the bible so this is the original way you got the Bible. So I'm a huge fan of paragraph Bibles. But, you know, you're not going to be taking it to church with you and stuff because you can't find what verse it is readily. Man, this is an amazing deal. But truth be told, both of them are amazing deals because it's a ministry. This Bible, easy, 150 buck Bible. If it's coming from Cambridge, R.L. Allen, Schuyler, somebody like that. So even $100 Bible coming from TBS, Trinitarian Bible Society, probably. So it, probably more because TBS doesn't use these quality of leathers by and large. Man, I hope this helps you some. The key is just read the Bible, but I do recommend, I'd recommend both these Bibles, and they both serve a purpose, and I recommend people reading the Bible through in a paragraph format. God bless. Love you in Jesus' name.